Hi everyone, welcome to another Sky Perspective Tech video. In this video, I'm going to share a few productive tips and tricks while I discovered using my Logitech K780 keyboard. By the way, this is not a review video of this Logitech keyboard. I'm just sharing with you some of the tips that I've discovered. Hope you like it. Okay, let's get on with it. On the top right of the screen, it shows my current Windows desktop. These tips that I'm about to show you works on Chrome browser running on Windows PC. They should actually work for most browsers. Let's start with the first tip. Because this Logitech K780 keyboard has round and thin keys with short key travel, I can actually use the edge of my palm to press the control key. Like this. Pressing down, release, pressing down, release, pressing down, release. So what's the use of pressing the control key like this? Let me show you. Our four fingers naturally rest on the most convenient position to execute shortcut commands. I can do Control 2 to change to the second tab, Control 1 to change back to the first tab, Control 4 to change to the fourth tab, Control 3, 2, 1, 4, 3 to hop over to any tab that I want. Realize that I'm just gently resting my hands on the control key to press it. Okay, on to the next tip. The, for the second tip, my pinky actually rests on the tap key over here. So, control tap allow us to just toggle through the tap on Chrome browser. So we can repeatedly press Control tap to tap through the tabs on the Chrome browser. Okay, next, another command that is pretty common, you might know this already, is Control r So the R key, once again, is very close to our index finger. We can go Control 3 and Control r to refresh the browser. Control 2 for the second tab, Control R to refresh the browser again. So we are kind of using all these commands in combination now. So we can Control tap to the tab, the, the tab that we want and then Control R to refresh it. Okay, wait, there's more. Now there is Control T. T is just beside R over here and Control t actually creates new tabs like so new tab new tab new tab and Control w closes a tab so i can do Control w w w Control tab open next tab open next tab Control w to close close all these shortcut commands are naturally resting at the convenience of my fingertips. And notice, I don't need to do gymnastic like when I'm using conventional keyboard. Conventional keyboard, we have to press Ctrl 3, Ctrl 2, or Ctrl tab, and Ctrl R to refresh. Because of this Logitech K780 keyboard, it has a very thin low profile keys. All I need to do is just rest my hand on the control key like so. So just to recap, there is control tap, control 1, 2, 3, 4, control W to close a tap, control T to open a new tab, control R to refresh. All of this is at the tip of our fingers. Okay, that's it for this video. Remember to also check out my other Logitech K780 videos where I had fun testing out the typing speed on this Logitech K780 keyboard. The links to those videos are in the description box down below. Let me know if my videos are helpful to you by liking this video and comment down below how I can make better videos for you. Thank you so much for watching. 
and hope you enjoy this video. See you in the next one.